also there's a couple of things happening today, um, one of which is um, a GJ post off appointment, so I'm going to go to that, see how that goes, and then another thing happening today, I'm actually meeting a, um, another Sigma ES or whatever, she's, she has Eller Stanlow's pots, she's two fed, you know, things like that, um, we actually live kind of close to each other, so I get to meet her today, I actually found her through YouTube, um, if you don't know of this channel, I would say check it out, um, her mom usually is the one who films, but it's about her, Savannah, and the kids, um, Savannah's what I'm meeting today, but here's the title of that channel right there, anyways, I would say go check it out, and, um, I'm just gonna like finish getting ready so I can go to my GJ post off appointment. Okay guys, I don't know how well you can hear me, but after fighting to find a parking spot, we finally got a parking spot. I'm finally in here, I'm waiting for my post off appointment. Um, today I'm going to ask them when I'll get my button changed, if you may or may not know, I have a GJ feeding tube, so it has to be done through interventional radiology, so it has to actually be scheduled. But we will see what happens. So guys, the appointment went well. I am getting drainage bags because after a month of having to modify old kangaroo jelly bags, which gets kind of difficult sometimes, I finally got to be able to order those. Um, we are talking about when I will be switching from my Dangler to my AMTG Jet, and I got to see what one of those are, except the little baby one, so it was like this big, and it was kind of adorable. Mine will be a whole lot longer than that, though. Um, and. If you don't know, um, I am looking into mouse or median accruciate ligament syndrome, and I have an appointment with a surgeon on December 17th for a consult, um, but there is some stuff he wants done before that, so I had talked today about um, getting those set up, and so we're going to see if this doctor can help me get those set up, and if not, we're going to see if my PCP can. So um, now I'm heading to Red Robin to meet Savannah from Uniquely Zebras, and we'll go from there. So guys, I'm here at Ben Robin to meet Uniquely Zebras. I forgot my mask. So I don't know how well you guys can hear me now. Hey guys, so I am leaving from getting to meet up with Savannah. I am again going to link their channel. It is right here. It is in your police heroes. Um, I would say definitely check them out. They're really amazing. And it was really amazing getting to meet somebody who's actually in the same state, even though we live different parts of the state. When you meet somebody who has got like the same issues as you and everything, even though there's some things that may be different, it really does change everything. Okay guys, I am home from my appointment. Um and for meeting Savannah. And I do wanna say something. Um, if you saw that little clip from Red Robin, and you're probably wondering like, okay, you can't eat, why'd you go to Red Robin? So, if I get a bite or two, you know, it's different, right? Um, that's not really eating, and it still does make me feel really sick. So I got like, my mom got like this BLT thing that came with the soup, and so we got a cup of the soup. Um, and I chose what soup it would be. But I took like a bite or two of it. Um, like, yeah, like a bite or two. And then I drained it out. So basically, that's how that is with me. Um, no, I can't actually eat, eat, but I can get like a bite or two and drain it, um, if that makes sense. So there is that. Um, fun fact. Um, Savannah, like I said earlier, she lives in the same state as me. And uh, she has Eller Stainless, like I do. She has POTS as well. And she has GA issues, as do I. Um, I am GJ tube fed, so I get fed in my small intestine and I drain out of my stomach. She is G tube fed, um, so she gets fed into her stomach. 
Um, but she has a J, or she has a Malone. I, don't know, well, I almost said J. She gets fed in her stomach, but she has a Malone, um, which goes to her large intestine. Um, I can't remember exactly, you know, what it's used for, but you can, like, check out Uniquely Zebras, like I was talking about earlier, um, to find more out more about that. Um, and, so yeah, there's, there's that. I'm at home, and I'm just kind of relaxing for now. Um, yeah. I'm really, really exhausted right now. Um, I go to school Monday and Tuesday, um, every week. Because my school's on hybrid model, and I am at home on Wednesdays, and then I'm also at home on Thursdays and Fridays. But Thursdays and Fridays, we do, like, Google Meets. It's kind of like Zoom. Um, and on Wednesdays, everybody's at home doing, like, remote classes, so you're just, you know, doing score for the day. There's no Google Meets with the teacher or whatever, which is why we try to do my appointments on Wednesdays. And, um, I had my appointment today, and then I met Savannah and Kelly you know, Kelly's Savannah's mom, um, and I came home and I was like, all right, I gotta do schoolwork. I have a whole web quest for my family studies to do. I have not finished that. Um, I just have to study for my anatomy class for a test I have on Monday. That's all I had to do for that. And then my third block's ACT prep, so I had nothing to do. Like, no work for that. My fourth block... Um, I'll have to recheck. I don't remember if I would work for that or not. Because I would never checked earlier. My fifth block is a two-page essay. Like, two-page continuation type essay. So, we just got through, like, this small story, whatever. And she wants us to use two and two to two and a half pages. And, like, continuing on from where the story left off. So... I have to do that, and I've only got a page done, and I'm exhausted as hell, and I don't want to finish. Hey guys, so I'm getting ready to go to bed, so I just want to say goodnight to you guys, and I love all of you, and thank you for watching this kind of short vlog.